It's always good to help out your community. But here at the Santa Clarita River, we're actually making a difference. Pickleball is one of the fastest growing sports in the U.S., so it only makes sense for the Michael Hoffman Foundation to hold a two-day tournament to combat childhood cancer. I'm Napoleon Problems III reporting for Canyons News, and today I'm here at the premiere of the Lilies of the Field here at Canyon Theatre Guild. Signing off for Canyons News, I'm Napoleon Problems III. Saturday, September 10th, Valencia Lanes hosted the sixth annual No Tap Bowling Tournament fundraiser. The event supports special needs adults to live independently and on their own terms. The nonprofit behind the event is Avenues Supported Living Services. It was created and operated by husband and wife duo Scott and Lori Shepard, and they've been running it since 1993. They serve Santa Clarita as well as a little bit of San Fernando Valley. Most rewarding things about doing what we're doing is that we're helping people who have developmental disabilities to have a life of their choosing. So we're not telling them what they should be doing. We're not forcing a career on them. We're actually finding out from them what they're interested in doing and helping them to reach their goals. Obviously, the point of the fundraiser is to help raise money for people who benefit from Avenue's supported living services. But it works twofold because it really gives the people a chance to feel like they're a part of the community at an event like this. First year we only had one session, and now we've got two sessions where we're filling most of the lanes. And anyhow, that makes it a lot of fun. Uh, we've also expanded. We've got a 50-50 opportunity. We've got a silent auction that goes on where we've been able to get a lot of uh, donations uh, from the community to go towards that. And so that's how we've been able to expand it over the years. And again, with this F-U-N with a capital F-U-N fundraiser. You can find out a plethora of ways to help this nonprofit through their website, avenuessls.org. Signing off for Canyons News, I'm Napoleon Province III. The Cougars baseball team had their last regular season home game this Friday against the Bakersfield Renegades. The Cougars came out to a hot start with getting the first three batters out at the top of the first and putting up six runs to start the first three innings. Pitching stayed consistent throughout the first four innings from Canyon allowing zero runs and base running became its own tool early by breaking the pitcher's focus which led to stolen bases. The Renegades put their first points on the board by scoring two runs in the fifth, but the Cougars had an immediate response by scoring three runs at the bottom of the sixth. Bakersfield then has their best inning at the top of the seventh by scoring five runs. Sure. I mean, we just have unreal confidence, more in the box, but I mean, we have confidence in our guys on the mound, and especially on defense. I mean, we know we can hit with anyone in the country, so we really just, we don't get down at any point in the game. And, even if we're down or we give up runs because we know we can put up five, six runs at any time in the game because we're that dangerous. To close out the game, each team only scored one more run, which brought the final score to 10 to eight. And the Cougars successfully defended home field for the final time this regular season. Your Cougars win! Final score, Canyon's Jim. And the Renegade take.